You hate ads, I hate ads. You know what I like? Patreon.com slash Inkdependence keeps this channel ad free. Hello folks, welcome to Ink Dependence. I'm Mike, and this is the Pilot Custom Heritage 912. And this is the Pilot Custom Heritage 912. And this is the Pilot Custom Heritage 912. You get the idea. These are three of the 15 available nib options for the Pilot Custom Heritage 912. And Pilot was uh, kind enough to loan me the set so that I could make a bunch of videos and show you how they all work. So uh, let's take a look at the big end of the spectrum here. I have pulled the broad nib, the double broad nib, and the extremely heckin' broad nib the C or course nib for our examination today. So if you'd like to see videos about some of the other unique nibs in this set, there will be a bunch of them on the channel. If you'd like to see a video about the 912 itself, there's also a video that just covers that pen and compares it to a bunch of others. Today though, in this video, let's check out these big boys. All right, so firstly, you can see that they all look much alike, and so it is a very good idea to keep the sticker on them so you can tell which nib you are picking up at any one time because these pens only come in black resin with these rhodium plated uh, hardwares, and so it could be a little confusing because you're gonna want more than one of these cool, cool pens. You can see they are all 14 karat gold nibs. They're all rhodium plated. They're all number 10s. And they're all marked broad, double broad, or C, respectively. All right, so let's do a little bit of uh, uh, looking at them sideways and you can see that the nib tipping there does definitely get a lot larger as you move from regular old run-of-the-mill broad up to double and then to the C which is the biggest available nib for these pens this thing is more or less a marker although it does uh, give you the ability to make some smaller strokes if you write with the tip so we'll take a look at how these three write as we go this is my Moriman Mnemosyne paper with a five millimeter grid, which will give us some idea of how broad these things are. The, fir uh, the first in our series, the broad nib here, gives you a really nice line weight. You don't get any line variation. This is a round tipped nib, so uh, verticals and horizontals will be the same, but it is uh, does have a nice generous flow. It gives you a good, uh, I think it just gives you a nice, uh, it gives it a nice line. I like a nice broad nib, and this is a really nice broad nib. We can go bigger, and that's the double broad here. And as you can see, there is a fairly good jump between the broad and the double broad. I don't know if it's twice as broad, but it is definitely a lot heavier line. Uh, you're getting more markery as we go here. And uh, this one is a very smooth operator as well. Then on, the, on to the C nib. The C nib is more or less marker size. It does put down a lot of ink and it does make a serious impact. You have a uh, really nice uh, line weight and strokes there. It is of course extremely smooth. And if you uh, do change your angle a little bit, this nib does have a bit of a flat spot there in the front. You can see this sort of chisely angle, which you don't really feel, but if you do go broader or if you go more vertical, you can get a, uh, a smaller line width out of this. And even a little bit of line variation, I think. Uh, so uh, this is not really a stub or anything of that nature, but the way that these are ground does give you the possibility to get slightly lighter uh, or rather thinner strokes if that's what you're looking for, while at the same time making big impact with your headings. So there you have it, the broad, double broad, and coarse nibs from the Pilot Custom Heritage 912. If you'd like to make an impact, you really can't go wrong with a C or a double B, or even just the regular old B for your regular broad everyday writing. These are very smooth and pleasant nibs to write with, and I hope you'll get to check them out sometime for yourself. Uh, let me know what your favorite big nib is down there in the comments, and I'll see y'all in another video. Peace out.